morning. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? Uh, good teacher. I am fine. I I I I am traffic. Oh really? You are in traffic right now? Yes, I Muy bien. Me falta por llegar. <laughs> May, uh, I will get home in a while, you can say. Llegaré en un rato. I will get home in a while. I I will get home a uh, while? In a while. In a while? En un rato. Yes. It's a, okay. Thank it's you. okay. It's okay. Just stay Thank connected, you. please. Stay connected, okay? Yes. Uh, solo quizás la cámara, porque como... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Angela. Okay, okay, Angela. Thank you. Um, yeah, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, Adriana is um is having a meeting. She said, right? Okay, yeah. Yes, teacher. Oh, but it finishes at eight thirty. Okay, no problem. Hello, Anna Michelle. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Good evening. Hello. Good evening, Miguel. How are you doing, Michelle? Oh, well, good. Very well. Oh, nice. Yes. Very good. It's good to see you. How are you, Miguel? Microphone. Hi, teacher. And you? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Excellent. Excellent. All right. It's good to see you. Hello, Darwin. Hello, teacher. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Welcome. Thanks. All right. Hello, Ada and Osmin and Jansi and Joanna. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? Fine, very good. Very nice, very good. Yes. Uh, Joanna, um, can you do me a favor? Hi, Joanna. Hi, teacher. Ahora estaba buscando su número. Cree que me lo me, me escribió un mensaje para registrarlo, por favor. Can you send okay, me a message yeah. to, to register, please? Okay. okay. Okay, please. Thank you. Sí, es que no lo tengo como como ustedes son de los que ingresaron despuesito, entonces no los tengo registrados. I don't have them registered. Okay. Okay, thank you. Por ahí me escribe, hola teacher, o hola Bernardo, soy Joana. Okay, so I can register the, the number in my contacts. Okay, everybody, so how was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? How was your weekend, your Sunday, your Saturday? It was good, bad, so-so. How was it? How was your weekend? For me, good, good teacher. Oh, nice. Very good, Angela. I like it. With family. Yes, with my family. Um, but, um, we I go to the church. Oh, really? Did you go to church and, on Sunday? But, yes, and then uh, um, my house with my family. Ah, and... you, you stay home with your family. Okay. Yes. Nice. Nothing better than family. Okay. Very good. Yes. Thank you, Angela. Thank you. Thank okay, you. Okay. Very good. What about the others? How was your weekend? How was your weekend? How was your weekend? Good evening. How was your weekend? Good evening. Good evening. Miguel? Yes. It's so so. So so. Not yes. so good. Not so good and not so bad. Not so good and not so bad. <laughs> Neutral. All right. Hi, Rafa. You driving? Yes. Okay. Very good. Just stay connected, please. Okay. Try to stay connected. Yes. All right. Very good. Okay, everyone. So um, I guess we are about to, to start. So I want to say welcome. Okay, to this um to this week of class. Okay. As you know, on Wednesday, we finish um, section two, right? On Wednesday, we finish section two. El miércoles terminamos la sección dos. 
I hope everybody is doing the exercises, okay? I hope everybody is doing the exercises or the homework on the platform, okay? And the homework, you know, section two is due uh, Wednesday before the session, okay? I repeat, uh, section two is due Wednesday before the session, okay? Es para el lunes antes de la sesión, para el miércoles, perdón, it's for, uh, for Wednesday before the, the session, okay? Antes de la sesión, yeah? Así que tienen todavía hoy, mañana, el miércoles para poder trabajar. Y antes de la sesión del miércoles, las, la, la sección 2 debe estar completa. Han tenido mucho tiempo para esto, ¿verdad? You had a lot of, a lot of time for this, ¿ok? Um, I know there, there, is an, uh -huh, there is an error, I guess, in the homework of Good Better, ¿ok? Creo que hay un, un error en la, en la sesión. No, bueno, hay, de hecho. Hay un error en la sesión de Wood Better, ¿ok? Pero, pero ya... Ya hice la, la consulta, ¿ok? Ya hice la consulta y estoy esperando, ¿ok? I am waiting, so don't worry, ¿ok? Son con dos, es con dos creo yo el problema. I don't know, it's with, with two, ¿all right? Yes, teacher, pero... Teacher, ¿verdad? Ya. Creo que en, en el error uno... En lugar de after work, es them. Ah, pero ese es en el de las... Ese es en el de las uh, transition words. Ese es en el de las transition ¿Sí? words. Ajá, es que hay otro error en la de would better. Ok, would better. De lo que vamos a estudiar hoy. Ajá, hay dos problemas ahí. Así que por ahí, ya hice la consulta. En, el, en, ese sí es, um, en ese sí hay solución, creo yo, en el de las transition words. En las de then, uh, first... Ajá. Uh -huh. There's solutions. Yes, teacher. En esa tengo problemas y en, y en otra también que, eh, que no me sale. Y... Ok. I, am, I asked already. Ok, ya hice la consulta. I asked already. All right. <laughs> y hoy no le dije am... nada porque digo, quizás yo me esté equivocando y como he estado mm. ocupada ahí en el trabajo, te lo dije yo en la noche, voy a tratar a intentar hacerla otra vez. No, en el good better, yes, there is a problem. Ok, en ese hay dos errores. There, there are two mistakes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, so it's okay, don't worry. I asked already. So let's start, so let me pass the attendance then. So you know that the section two is due Wednesday before the session, right? Okay, so let's start with the attendance. Ada? Present. Adriana? Adriana? Present, teacher, present. Okay, Ana Michelle? Ana Michelle? Microphone. Present, present, present. All right. Angela. Present teacher. Darwin. Present teacher. Very good. Floor. Present teacher. Very good. Gloria. Here. Great. Joanna. I am here teacher. Good. Lourdes. Present. Okay. Margarita. I'm here. <laughs> Ready for the class, Margarita? Yes, ready Perfect. for the Perfect. class. Teacher. Perfect, that's very good. No meeting today, right? No meeting, today. no meeting today. No teacher. Okay, perfect. Mayra? Miguel? Present. Very good. Nelson? Mayra is saying that she's just a listener. Okay, thank you, Mayra, for informing. Uh, Nelson? Ophelia? Here, teacher. Oh, okay. Osmin? Present teacher, good evening. Good evening. Rafael? Present. All right. Rosa? Good evening, present. Oh my goodness, good morning. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, Rosa. Sandra? Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Jansi? All right. Okay, thank you. Sulma? Present. Very good. Asalia? Ingrid? And Susan? Asalia is connected, I think, but she is not answering. Okay. Uh, Susana? <clears throat> All right. Okay, very good. Okay, everyone. So, um, so I repeat. I want to say Teacher, welcome. Present. All right, Nelson. 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 Okay. So, all right, everyone. So, welcome again. 
I want to say welcome again to this uh, session. Ah, um, yeah, 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 basically, this unit has been a, very this, anotando, eh? yeah, this unit has been very long, right? Okay. Esa unidad se ha ido un poquito larga. Has been very, very long, all right? But it's part of the part of the contents, all right? That this unit is two weeks, basically, okay? So, but on Wednesday, we finish unit number two, and then we go to unit number four, number three, sorry, and then to number four, okay? One week for each. Solo esta semana es la que era un poquito larga. Estas dos semanas anteriores, okay? Uh, we're a little long. But the, the following two weeks are normal, okay? Uh, one section for one week. All right, uh, so I did, just to remember, okay, on Wednesday, I had few people. But I remember on Wednesday, we started some vocabulary, okay? We started some vocabulary in an index, okay? And you remember that you were working with the index, right? Yeah, estuvieron trabajando con ese índice. Okay, it was for, a, for a, the, end, the index of a training manual, all right? So what vocabulary do you remember from the index? What vocabulary do you remember from the index? ¿Qué vocabulario, vocabulario recuerdan del índice? What vocabulary do you remember from the index? Decanting the, the wine. Ah, decanting wine. What else? Setting a table. Setting a table, exactly. What else? Setting a table. A table, sorry. Call. Decanting wine. Sorry? Dress code. Call. A dress code, exactly. Dress code, dress what code. else? Yes. Dress code. Okay, thank you. Um, and following the schedule. Ah, following the schedule, right? Following the schedule. Following the schedule. El, el horario. Following the schedule. What else? ¿Qué más? What else? About tips and taxes. About tips and taxes, all right? About tips taxes. and taxes. Uh -huh, exactly. What else? Addressing, 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 addressing customers, customers addressing customers, exactly. Uh, Darwin, you were saying? The prevention of accidents and safety. Exactly, prevention of accidents and safety, okay? You're missing like two, faltan como dos, pero you're missing like two or three. Requesting a shift, change. Requesting a shift, change. change, very good. Yeah. And the last one? Getting... To know the menu. Getting, getting, getting to know the menu, exactly. <laughs> getting to know the, the menu. menu. Yes. Yeah. Now, uh, what is uh, setting a table? Sirviendo la mesa. Sirviendo la mesa, o poniendo la mesa, okay. Arlando la mesa, okay. Setting a table, okay. Good. And what is, um, what is the canting wine? De cantar el vino. De cantar el vino. And what is de cantar el vino? Tell me a definition. Eh, pasarlo a otro recipiente. ¿no? Exactly. Eh, to pass it to another recipient, otro recipiente. or container. Uh -huh. Exactly. Uh -huh. Okay, that's correct. Thank you. Uh, le okay, let's see another one. Requesting a chip change, what is that? Requesting a chip change. When you change the schedule. You change it? The schedule or the day maybe okay yes i would say that the, the the schedule okay it's better all right good uh it's like pedir un o solicitar un cambio de turno okay to request a or requesting a chip change very good and what is uh following the schedule following the schedule yeah. what is that seguir el horario cumplir con el horario yes okay following the schedule all right, and what is addressing kitchen personnel? Addressing exactly addressing kitchen personnel is dirigir el personal de la cocina. Very good. Remember, address in this case you are teacher, but address is dirección. Is correct. Okay, but in this case it's like dirigiendo, right? So it's different. Okay, so it's a verb. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, getting to know the menu. What is that? Getting to know the menu. Conocer el menú. Conocer el menú. Okay. It's like when you say, for example, getting to know someone. Conocer a alguien. Getting to know someone. Or getting to know a place. Conocer un lugar. Okay. Getting to know. Okay. Conocer. Get to know. 
Very good. Getting to uh, know people. Getting to know people, exactly. Ajá, conocer gente. Uh, what is dress code? Dress code. Código de vestimenta. Código de vestimenta, dress code. Very good. And what is uh, addressing customers? Dirigirse a los clientes. Okay, dirigirse a los clientes o dirigir a los clientes. Dirigirse a los clientes, Dirigir a los I would clientes. say. Dirigirse a los okay. clientes, it's better. Okay, addressing customers. Very good. And the next is about tips and tactics. What is that? Pagar. Acerca de propinas e impuestos. Ah, acerca de propinas e impuestos, right? Propinas e impuestos. Propinas e impuestos. Acerca de propinas e impuestos. About tips and taxes. Teacher, but tip es un tip de, de algo. Okay, a tip. No, but in this case, in, in restaurants, tips is propina, okay? And taxes is impuestos, all right? And let's see the last one. Veamos la última. Prevention of accidents and safety. What is that? Prevenir accidentes. Okay, prevenir accidentes y seguridad. Y seguridad. Prevención de accidentes y seguridad. Prevention of accidents, accidents and uh, safety. All right. This is just to remember. Okay. This is just to remember. But uh, on Friday at the end of the class, uh, you were um, trying. Okay. You were trying in groups. Uh, you were trying to organize uh, the the index, right? Okay, you were trying to organize the index. Quick question. Uh, did you organize the index? Todos organizaron el, el índice? Did everyone organize the index? Yes or no? Organize. You were working in groups, right? Yeah. You were working in groups. Yes. Yes. More or less. More or less. I will, um, do you need more time? Yes. Do you need more time? Yes. Okay. I have the teams here. Just tell me if it's true. Ada, Flor, and Susana were together, even juntas, right? Azalia, Miguel, and Osmin, yes, right, together. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Angela, Gloria, and Urdes together, right? Adriana, yes. yes. Okay, oh, okay, I have the, the correct groups then. Okay, then, um, just to, to remember, on Friday at the end, uh, you were organizing the index on page number 21, okay? The idea was to put it organized Okay, I mean, according to your perspective, de acuerdo a su perspectiva, according to your point of view, all right? Yeah, so you were putting it in yeah. order, yeah? Si alguien no se conectó el viernes, se une el equipo que decida. You can join any team you want, okay? Yes, y como siempre, hacer la solicitud de que la cámara esté encendida, por favor, okay? Como siempre, al menos que algunos que yo sé que van en bus, que no le encienden por eso, right? Pero los demás siempre hacen la solicitud que la cámara esté encendida siempre. Es un requisito de esa forma, así que... Por favor, yeah, tratemos de, de yeah, seguirla. Los que yeah, están en el bus no se preocupen, ¿ok? If you're in the bus or driving, don't worry. Y si están en el bus okay, manejando, no se preocupen. Pero yo sé que algunos no lo están, ¿ok? Some people are not. Good. Then I will give you 10 minutes, ¿ok? In 10 minutes, try to finish organizing uh, the index. Are 10 minutes, ¿ok? ¿Están bien 10 minutos? Are 10 minutes, ¿ok? Yes, yes, yes. Rem remember. Remember that you need to justify your organization, all right? Deben justificar su organización. You need to justify your organization, okay? For example, I think um, number one is decanting wine because, and then you explain. You dan una media explicación. You can give a little explanation, okay? Any question? No? No, it's clear, teacher. Okay, para la organización de los equipos. Equipo número uno es Ada, Flor y Susana. Equipo número dos, Azalia Miguel en Osmin. Equipo número tres, Ángela, Gloria y Lourdes. Equipo número cuatro, Adriana, Jansi, Zulma. Equipo número cinco, Darwin, Ingrid, Nelson. Equipo número seis, Joana, Ofelia, Rafael. Si hay alguien que no se conectó el viernes, se une al equipo que quiera. You are free, all right? Son libres de unirse al que quieran. You can join any team you want. So let's make the groups and join the group I assign, please. Únanse al grupo que, en el que están, por favor, okay? Y los que no estaban el viernes, se pueden unir a cualquiera. You can join any team you want. Okay, let's go to work. Okay. 10 minutes, all right, 10 minutes.
Y si él te puedes unir al equipo que tú desees, ¿ok? You can join the team you want, ¿ok? Ok. All right. Estoy viendo los grupos. Ok, it's ok. Mayra, hello Mayra, can you listen to me? Hello Mayra. Mayra, si, si me estás escuchando, eh, quita la palabra de oyente que tienes entre paréntesis, porque eso es para los que están como oyentes. Si tú solo estás escuchando la clase, no importa, solo que informes por si estás en una reunión, por favor, ok, please. Teacher. Hello. Can you remember me what group is mine? Let me see. Rafael, group number six. Okay, thanks. Okay. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hello. Teacher, I, I am, I am come late, and and understand everything. Do you do you what to do? Uh, right now. Do you... the index? Ah, okay. So you organize the index. Yes. Yes. Ah, okay. So um, that's it. Okay, you only need to. To, to work on that, and then you are going to explain your organization to the class, okay? For example, you can say, uh, we put the oh. counting wine in number one because we consider it's very important, maybe, right? Oh, and we okay, put okay. in number two, we put um, getting to know the menu, for example, I don't know, all right? So uh, you oh, need okay, to explain okay. your decision, okay? Okay, okay, Bien. Yeah. ahorita. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Ada, we made okay. it. O sea que tenemos que explicar según para nosotros por qué se puso. O sea, por ejemplo, como nosotros pusimos en el primero, getting to know the menu, entonces, por guay. Ajá, por. Poner la mesa. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The reason, the reason why. The reason why. The reason yeah. why. Ok. Ok, está bien. Thank you. Gracias. Ok, my pleasure. Ok, Ada, what do you think? Okay. In the first, getting to know the menu. ¿Por qué el conocimiento? I think it's the base. It's the base for know the restaurant, your vestment, your... It's the base. I think. Yes. Eh, I could, I could, creo que se dice, podría ser, ¿verdad? I ¿Sí? could... Este, the base en, según cómo se, bueno, según el, 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 el la, la, la política del, del restaurante. Vamos a decir. Uh -huh. 
According, este, according to the policy. According to the policy. De acuerdo, con, de acuerdo con la política. According to the policy. Ok. Ah, ok. Yeah. Policy. 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 No, according to the policy. According policy. to the policy. De acuerdo a la política. According, according to the policy. Okay. Yeah. Prevention of accident. Lo podríamos dejar así. No se ve. Que andaba buscando algo, pero no lo encuentro. Ya estoy, estoy viendo como lo, Michael lo, lo ha puesto. Ah. Uno, código de cementa, dos. Dirigirse al personal de cocina, puso él. One, two, el menú. one, two, three, one, two, three, four. English, you five. know the numbers. Okay, five. Six, six. seven, eight, eight nine. nine. Uh, better. Uh, dress, Sentence. Cut. Number two. Mm, number two. This can... Addressing kitchen personnel. Number three. Now the menu. Number four. Uh, sitting at table. Number five. Uh, addressing customer. Addressing, addressing customer. Mm. Number six. Number six is the kind of wine. Number seven. Number seven is about about it and text. Number eight. Uh, following the schedule. And number nine. Uh, uh, requesting a chef chain. A series of Miguel. Number nine. Number nine. Change the, the orders. What do you think? For example, I was reading a menu. Uh, from some restaurants and the first thing that they put in the manual is the higiene okay higiene higiene personal in that case i don't mm -hmm. i don't know how how can i say higiene personal <gasps> Only, uh, only if uh, this item don't don't have in this in this okay, month. But, no. but okay, but in this case, maybe prevention of accidents is I think. I don't no. know. I was thinking after after antes after uh, after all the. Es lo primero que el cliente ve. La presentación, vea. El código de la vestimenta. Ajá, el código de la vestimenta. ¿Y ese dónde lo tenemos nosotros? Lo tenemos... Estaba, ay, se fue Nelson. Se marchó. 
<risa> bueno, pero nosotros lo tenemos, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, de quinto lo teníamos nosotros. Ajá. Pero no se ve, yo porque como lo, la presentación es lo primero. Pero no sé. Sorry, I have a problem. I have problem my my connection, internet. But in at the moment I connected my 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 the internet the my phone. Eh, Give me a question, eh, Darwin. Eh, mencionaba Michelle que para ella el punto número uno sería el séptimo, el dress code, el código de vestimenta. Ajá, porque es la presentación, o sea, la forma en cómo se debe de, 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 de vestir el, el, el mesero. Pero no sé. ¿Es posible? ¿Es posible? Entonces, y... podemos poner el 7 y bajamos todo lo demás de la lista. Sí, porque sería yo veo que es, ajá, está, está aceptable. Está aceptable. ¿Se aprueba por 84 votos? <risa> <risa> en el Congreso. Ok. Vale, entonces solo ese sería el cambio, Nelson. Subir el 7 de 1 y de ahí bajar todo el listado que tenemos. Ok. De acuerdo en la sesión plenaria. ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. Vaya, luego teníamos de Canting Wine. Esto sería lo mismo que este, solo que el anterior. Ajá. Que se cante, que se cante. Addressing kitchen personal. Addressing. Como dirigirse. Pues tiene que saber enseñar. Saber enseñar. Es importante pero, un, 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 tener un buen equipo de trabajo. Es importante saber enseñar uh -huh. para tener un equipo de trabajo. Pero como este es un manual, uh -huh. no, es como... Bueno, pero... Mm. Any uh -huh. idea, teacher? <laughs> este... Sorry. <risa> en, en este caso la número 9 teacher que dice addressing kitchen personnel eh, como este es un manual para los servers Exacto. entonces estaría enfocado en cómo ellos tienen que dirigirse al personal de cocina no cómo dirigir al personal de cocina exactly, exactly. ok vaya entonces en, ah, pues entonces así sería, niña. Te, tenemos que ponerle por qué es importante que ellos sepan cómo eh, dirigirse al personal de la cocina. Ah, los meseros al personal de la cocina. Ajá, Con respecto. Con respecto. Poner como... Ok, everyone. So, are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, no? Yes, teacher, yes. Uh, um, um, um. A little. A little, okay. Just please say what you, you didn't finish. Teacher, with Ada, don't finish the explication. Okay, Only yes, the words. 
Just okay, no problem. It's okay. Just share the order you have, okay? Because we have no more time for this. Okay, so um, okay. we are going to start with uh, group number six, okay? Now with group number one. Now we are going to change the order. So group number six is Joanna, Ophelia, Rafael. Y si se le agregó alguien más, no sé, ¿verdad? Igual a todos los equipos. Me imagino que se le agregó alguien a algunos. So Joanna, Ophelia, and Rafael's team. Do you want to share? Yes, teacher. Okay, we, we are done finish the MVC. Okay. Just, no lo terminamos. Ah, okay, just share the, 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 the order and you can okay. give a little explanation maybe. Okay, go ahead. Okay. okay, number one, dress code. Number two, addressing customer. Number three, setting a table. Number four, getting to know the menu. Number five, addressing kitchen personal. Number six, the country Y. Number seven, about tips and taxes. Yeah. Number eight, following the schedule. Number nine, requesting a shift change. And number 10, prevention of accidents and safety. Okay, Joanna, uh, can you repeat uh, what you have in number one, please? Number, number one. Number one, dress code. Dress code. Why do you think a dress code is the most important? Because the presentation is very important in a right. restaurant. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Okay. It's totally true. Okay. It's excellent. And what do you have in number 10? Uh, number 10 is prevention of accidents and safety. Why do you think this is not so important? We are done finish. We don't finish, teacher. <laughs> oh, you didn't finish. Oh, okay. In the number six. In the number six? Ah, yeah. Uh, in number 10, what do you have in number? Oh, you didn't finish the order. No terminaron el orden. You didn't finish the order. Hasta la no, in the number six. Ah, okay. I see. Okay. It's okay. No problem. Okay. Thank you very much, Joanna's group. Now let's listen okay. to Darwin, Ingrid, and Nelson. Hello. Hello. It's your turn. It's your turn. It's your turn. Ah, okay. In the case, my group select the the index number one dress code. Number two, addressing customers. Number three, prevention of accident and safety. Number four, getting to know the menu. Next, following the schedule. Next, saving a table. The canting wine. Um, address kitchen personnel. Number nine, requesting a shift change. And finally, about tips and taxes. About tips and taxes. Okay, Darwin. Uh, for, for Darwin's group, okay? For everybody, para todos, for everybody. Uh, why do you think dress code is number one? Why do you think dress code is number one? Why? The reason. Darwin Nelson or uh, or Ingrid? Or Michelle. Or Michelle or, or Michelle, all right. Why do you think dress code is number one? Why? I think I think this uh, that is the same the uh, because the dress code is the um, the most important for a waiter. Okay. Very good. So what, what you wear, what you wear, it's important for uh, for customers and for a waiter. Okay. Thank you, Michelle. And in the last one, you have about tips and taxes in number 10, right? Uh, what do you, why do you think about tips and taxes is number 10? Why? Why is tips and taxes in number 10? Why? Uh, for, for group. 
I think um, is is finally the service, but it's import import by, by wider is now the the taxis um, in the moment. Okay, yeah. so that, that's not important by that moment. Okay. Yeah. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you very much, Nelson's group. Okay, we give the lights later. Okay, let's listen to Adriana, uh, Jansi, and Zulma. Okay. Um, Jansi, you start. Okay. Yes. Microphone. Uh, number one, productions of Asian newspaper. It is first chapter because it is the face of life and the new security. Hey, can you repeat, please? Jansi, can you repeat, please? Solma, puede iniciar usted en la que vamos. Sí, sí, sí. Eh, the first is prevention of accident and safety. Two, following the schedule. Three, requesting a shift change. Four, dress call. And five, addressing customer. Okay. Six, getting to know the menu. Seven, turning a table. Eight, the canteen of five. Nine, addressing kitchen kitchen personnel, and then about teeth and taxes. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, question. Uh, why do you think prevention of accidents and safety is the most important? Why? Uh, because is the first charter because the safety of clients and employees is priority in the company. Uh, I like it very good. So the, the customer security is priority in the company. Good, I like it. I like that. I like your uh, your opinion about this. Okay, and why do you think about tips and taxes is not uh, is in number? Why is it in number ten about tips and taxes? Because, because it's, it's a general. general. Okay, okay. Uh, Sulma, uh, okay, Sulma. Let's give the chance to Jansi. Okay, thank you, thank you, Sulma. I know you want. To. Okay, uh, Jansi. Because the tip is optional and voluntary for the server. All right. So here is here, at least in El Salvador, is voluntary, right? But in some countries, it's mandatory. All right. In some countries, it's mandatory. But here is not the case. All right. It, maybe it depends on the restaurant. In some restaurants here, uh, you tip, but in others, you don't. Okay. Thank you very much, Jansi and Sulma's group. All right. Now let's listen to Angela, Gloria, and Lourdes. Okay. Hello, everybody. Hello. Uh, the for for uh, our group, uh, we decide this order because uh, for us it's very important the servers know the menu. Oh. Uh, for attend a uh, of better way to the customer, and for us is the most important uh, getting to know the menu. And because it's necessary, the servers know very well the menu. Mm -hmm. uh, first step for us, uh, getting to know the menu. Second, addressing a uh, kitchen personnel. And uh, number three, dress code. Number four, setting a table. Number five, the canteen wine. Number six, addressing customers. Uh, number seven, about tips and taxes. Number eight, following the schedule. Number nine, requesting a chief change. And number 10, prevention of accidents and safety. The, these steps is uh, no less important is, but um, is, is a step that uh, the servers um now the 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 different ways uh, to prevent of accidents okay all right so 
Uh, okay, very good. Okay, thank you. This could could be right, could be the case, or it couldn't be the case that they know. Okay, how to prevent accidents. Okay, but but it, I said, yeah. I mean, it's personal. I mean, it's the way you decided. Okay, so I I am not going to say no. This is correct or this is incorrect. I mean, it's it's your organization, so it's fine. Okay, no problem. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, to this group. Okay, to our Lourdes group. And now let's listen to the next group. Asalia, Miguel, and Osmin. Hello. Hello. Uh, good evening. Uh, uh, for our group, uh, these, uh, these steps is the number one is prevention of accident of safety. Number two, uh, dress code. Number three, addressing kids and personal. Uh, uh, do you have the screenshot of this? Uh, Asalia or Rose or? I got it. Okay, okay, okay let's continue, no, please. No, number four, getting to know the menu. Number five, setting a table. Uh, number six, uh, addressing customers. Maybe Osmin can help us. Okay, okay. Number seven, decanting wine. Number eight, about tips and taxes. Sally. Number nine, following the schedule. Uh, number ten. Requesting a chief change. Yes, yeah, teacher. Okay, okay. So, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, why do you think uh, prevention of accidents in safety is number one? Why? Because the client is more important in my restaurant. Oh, because the clients are the most important thing in your restaurant. Very good. Yeah. Uh, any any yes. other opinion from the group? Any other opinion from the group? No? No, all right. It's okay. It, it's okay, all right, very good. So in number 10, you have about tips and taxes, or I don't remember very well. In number 10, what do you have in number 10? Um, number one, teacher. No, number 10. No, no number, 10. 10. number 10, number 10. Uh, yeah, yeah. requesting a chief change. Ah, or requesting a chief change. A chief change. A chief change. A chief change. Okay. I know this is important, but why do you think this is the least important? Why do you think this is the least important in the manual? Why? Why is it the least important for you? Por qué es la menos importante para ustedes? Why is it the least important for you? Any idea? Uh, because I uh, we think uh, because it's not important the, uh, the chains of the the requesting the, the chief is not important is is more important the clients. Okay, very good. I like it. Okay, so the chiefs are not so important, right? That can be dealt with later. Okay, thank you, Miguel. Thank you very much. Thank you, group. Thank you very much for sharing. And let's listen to the last group: Ada, Flor, and Susana. Okay, good evening. Good evening. Uh, okay, index of the training manual of a restaurant. Number one, getting to know the menu. Two, setting a table. Third, the guiding wine. Four, addressing kitchen personnel. Five, addressing customers. Six, the stress code. Seven, about tips and taxes. Eight, following, following the schedule. Nine, requesting a shift things. Number 10, prevention of accidents and safety. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, we have something different here. Getting to know the menu. Why is getting to know the menu the most important for you? Why? We think that it could be the base that goes according to the, po the restaurant's mm. policy. 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 Okay. Okay. Very interesting. 
Now, why do you think um, you said the least important is prevention of accidents and safety, right? Number 10. Yes. Yes, why is yes. it number 10? Because general preservation information is taught to staff according to their position in the restaurant. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got it. Okay, thank you very much, Susana's uh, group. Thank you very much. Now, everyone, uh, go to reactions and give each other a heart. Okay, desen un corazón todos. Give each other a heart. Give each other a heart, please. Everybody, give each other a heart. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, thank you very much for your presentations. Listen, please. Uh, don't lose this uh, order of uh, steps. No pierdan este orden de pasos que tienen, porque ya vamos a hacer otra actividad más adelantito con ese orden que tienen, okay? With this order right. you have. So please, keep it there. Manténganlo ahí a la mano. Keep it close to you, all right, please. Okay. I mean, basically you agree in some steps, right? Like the majority of the groups uh, agreed that uh, step number one is, for example, getting to know the menu, um prevention of accidents and safety and the other one is that that you think it's important is um, or basically these two right dress code. Ah, and the dress code, dress, and code. The dress code okay and it's true okay i mean these three are, are are some of the most important ones okay you are right okay thank you very much for uh sharing with the class all right now we are going to the next activity listen um okay let me share let me stop here something okay i want to ask a question in general okay how many how many of you cuántos de ustedes how many of you um have completed the homework about wood better how many of you completed the homework about wood better or wouldn't eat better cuántos han completado esa, esa tarea en la sesión wood better no, no. Eat better? only one question I have problem. I know, I know. Yeah. Yes, yes. I know. And only I one. And I reported that. Ya lo reporté. I reported that. All right, I reported that. Only Rosa has completed. Rosa, did I you find any? But, but, I, but I have the two, the two mistakes. I know. Okay, there I are two mistakes. I only one mistake. Oh. oh my God. I have two. <laughs> it's only in wouldn't it better, right? It's only in wouldn't it better. So I have a mistake, but that And wouldn't yes. it better. Yes. Yo creo que, ok, solo, yo creo que para el otro el error es que tiene un extra space al final. Creo, si no estoy seguro. ¿Sí, Miguel? ¿O me equivoco? Es la número 5. La número 5, creo que hay que darle un espacio extra al final. Let me check, teacher. Ok. Ok, let's wait for Miguel to, to, to tell us. I think that's the mistake. No sé, si, no sé si para una la W de inicio es minúscula, teacher. Ya vamos a ver ahorita, ok. This is important, so let's wait for Miguel to, to share. Ok, so in the meantime, maybe Miguel you can share in a moment, ok? And we continue with the class. So listen. Micro. Microphone. Teacher, teacher, let me show. No, the, listen, teacher. The... Teacher. No, teacher, hear no listen. Teacher, I know. I hear you. Teacher. Listen. Se desconectó. Hi. Teacher. Teacher. No, you. listen, I teacher. Houston, we had a problem. We had a problem. We had a problem. <laughs> Teacher. Teacher. Hello. Asenas, teacher. Consegna de no la clase. Teacher, no lo vimos. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. teacher. See you tomorrow, you tomorrow. teacher. Good night. <laughs> Good 
Can you listen to me? En las oraciones. Yes. 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 Copy. En la 2.11 es, es en la 2.11, Miguel. En la tarea 2.11. Esa copy de todo. This. I have wrong only this. Copy, copy. Solo es en la incorrecta. Uh, I, yes. I only have this. I say, I say question. In Miguel, Miguel, uh, can you do yes. me a favor, please? Al final, yes. al final, eh, ¿puedes darle un espacio extra, por favor? Vaya, antes del signo de interrogación, antes del signo de interrogación, no, antes del signo de interrogación. Check now, please. No. Same go up, please. Same problem. Yes. Same solo, problem. En ese, solo en ese da problema, ¿verdad? That's the only problem. Uh, yes, I only was only this problem. Okay, ¿a quién le daba problemas otra? Otra. A mí la dos. La dos. Pero la dos está bien, ¿verdad? Solo va minúscula la primera, creo, ¿no? Se metió la O. Ah, ok. No, that, yeah, that one's okay. Ese está bien. That's okay. Wouldn't it be? Wouldn't it be better? Uh, wouldn't it be better uh, to, revise to revise the manual, the manual before printing? Before printing. A printing, ajá. Uh yeah, that's okay. Solo sería la última, entonces la que. Pero ya hice la consulta, okay. Solo es el number five, okay. I let you know tomorrow. Okay, okay thank you. Stop sharing, please, Miguel. Ya no le des copy. Other, 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 other. Piche, Other, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You have to work on your homework. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thank you very yeah, much, Miguel. Thank you. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right. Yeah, ya sacada la copia, ya sacada. <laughs> <laughs> Too fast. All right. So, uh, this is the event. Um, so I will I will let you know tomorrow, okay, about number five because I asked already. Ya ya pregunté. Me dijeron que iban a revisar. They said that they were they are going to to check, okay? Number five. Okay, thank you, Miguel. Thank you very much for sharing, okay? And for not giving copy. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Sí, pero yo tengo Thanks, exactamente copy. igual la, box, la pregunta box. número, la oración número dos y no me deja pasar. Y está really? tal cual lo ha puesto a mi... Igual yo. Mira, igual yo. Tal cual lo ha puesto a mi... Can you read it? Pero le han puesto mi núcleo al principio. Sí. Yes. yes. Pueden, eh, Michelle, me la puedes mandar así como la tienes al WhatsApp, por favor, y voy a revisar en un momentito mientras están haciendo una actividad. Okay. Please, okay, okay, let's, okay, okay, to my WhatsApp, all right, not to the group, to my WhatsApp. <laughs> okay. Yes, Ingrid? Okay, uh, okay, let's continue then. Okay, listen, on this next part of the, of the class, we have the use of uh, good bear. Now, please, um, now, please, in this part, I want you to pay a lot of attention. Okay, aquí sí quiero que pongamos mucha atención. Pay a lot of attention here. Now, listen, uh, we have the use of um, would better, all right? So the idea of would better, of would better is uh, to show or to express a strong advice or suggestion, okay? Advice or suggestion. Yes, like should, for example, okay? To express advice or suggestion, okay? Use like using should. And you say, it would be better, and then you use a verb, y luego usamos un verbo, to let, to go, to listen, to study, all right? So after it would be better, usamos un verbo, okay, in infinitive, right? To let, to go, to listen, to play, all right? And let's look at the example. It would be better to let employees decide what processes to change, for example, okay? So basically, we have the subject, it. Would be better, okay, would be better. And then we have the verb in infinitive. ¿Qué es un verbo infinitivo? Es ponerle el tú al verbo. To go, to listen, to play, to study, to show, okay? 
to infer, to transfer. Yes, that's an infinitive verb. Ese es un verbo infinitivo. En español sería terminado en ar, er, ir. Comer, bailar, trabajar, degustar. Okay, so that's a verb in infinitive Leer. in Spanish. Yes, leer, beber. All right, very good. Now let's continue with, the, with this. Second example. It would be better to let a manager take care of the situation. The same structure, la misma estructura. Subject could be better. Verb in infinitive and complement, right? It would be better to let a manager take care of the situation, okay? And we have other uses. Y tenemos también otros usos. We have other uses. For example, would you prefer, okay? Would you prefer uh, for alternatives, okay? Would you prefer uh, to drink coffee or tea, for example? Or would you prefer uh, to go today or tomorrow? Okay, would you prefer to go today or tomorrow? Wouldn't it be better? No sería mejor. La misma estructura, okay? Después del wouldn't it be better, tenemos un infinitive verb, okay? So wouldn't it be better um, to start the class before eight, for example? Wouldn't it be better to start the class before eight? No sería mejor empezar la clase antes de las ocho. Is a suggestion or alternative, okay? And the last one, it would be good if. Sería bueno si. And we have the example. It could be good if we had a profession to complete the manual, all right? Sería mejor si tuviéramos un profesional para completar el manual. Pay attention to something important here. It would be better if, el otro verbo va en pasado, si se fijan, right? The verb is in past, okay? It would be better if we had a professional to complete the manual. You can say, for example, it would be better if we studied more English. If it would be better if we studied more English. Sería mejor si estudiáramos más inglés. So the verb in past, el verbo en pasado. It would be better if we worked, for example. It would be better if we worked. Sería mejor si trabajáramos five days a week. It would be better if we worked five days a week. So in conclusion, en conclusión, en esta oración el verbo va en pasado. The verb is in past. Okay? What is the meaning of it would be better? El significado de it would be better sería mejor. Sería mejor, and then the verb being infinitive. Wouldn't it be better? No sería mejor hacer algo, okay? Wouldn't it be better to do something, okay? So, any question about this topic? Yes. Okay, uh, Miguel. If the, if the sentences uh, have if, the, the verb is in the past. Exactly. Okay. Like in this case, okay, the sentence is with if, so the verb is in past. El verbo siguiente va en pasado. Mm -hmm. Cher, pero las opciones cuando dice así no sería mejor. O sea, el verbo en pasado, pero es como una... Futuro. Es, como, es como una opción del, del, del presente, de, de, de cómo... Mm -hmm. Yeah, the intention. Yeah, I, I know. The, the intention uh -huh. of the sentence. Uh -huh. The intention uh -huh. of the sentence in Spanish is sería mejor si tuviéramos, pero no tenemos. It's like a. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Así like tiene que ir en pasado. Uh -huh, It's like verbo. a wish. Uh -huh. Es como uh -huh. un verbo. It's like a wish. Kind of like a wish. Okay. okay. Más o menos un deseo, pero no uh -huh. es así. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Any other question? Confused. <laughs> Confusing. Confused porque eh, tuviéramos, se oye como que es futuro o, y no le decimos. De hecho, tenido, yeah. Ajá, de hecho, es como un deseo. Es como una, como un, ¿qué? como una, como un efecto, something like that. I would say deseo, sería como un deseo. Es It would be better if. if. Ajá, sorry. Quien manda es el if. It would be better, esto. Sería mejor si. Okay, it would be better if. Okay. 
su posición. That's the most important here. So, any other question? No. For example, the verb eat. Tenemos el verbo eat is in present, right? In past is eight. En pasado es eight. Eight. Okay. So in the sentence you say, it would be better if we ate more proteins, for example. Sería mejor si comiéramos más proteínas. It would be better, or good, sorry. It would be good if we ate more proteins. Okay? El verbo va en pasado. Si comiéramos más proteínas. If we ate more proteins. Okay? Just to give you another example. Solo para darles otro ejemplo. So do we have any other question? Do we have any other question? Yes. Eh, eh, no sé si me confundí, pero también vi que estaba no solamente el if, sino que también cambiaba, porque eso no me había fijado. Que el otro es it will be better, y el otro es it will be good. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. O sea, you can say better too. You can say better. It will be better if. It's possible ah, it too. Be better if. Ah, teacher. Okay. The two options are possible. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, that sad yes. is is question because it, it, it changed in, in, in the grammar and the chain uh, 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 object or subject chain. In which sentence? Yes, and uh, uh, and the, the example of the the the, the writer the the books. Mm -hmm. I, I don't get you. Now, so can you repeat your uh, your comment, please? Wouldn't it be better? Uh -huh. El subject change because oh, it's, it's oh, question. I got you. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Thank you, Nelson. Thank you very much. You're very amiable. Uh, so, yes, Nelson is right. In this case, wouldn't it be better? The subject is different. It goes in another position, right? Because it's a question. El sujeto va en otra posición porque es una pregunta, incluyendo alternativa, including alternative. So you say, wouldn't it? Or in this one, would you? El you? Okay, it's afterwards. Yeah, thank you, Nelson. Thank you very much. Okay, that's very important. Okay, any other question? No questions? No, everything clear? Okay, let me pass the attendance again, please. Ada? Present. Adriana? Adriana? Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present teacher. Darwin. Present teacher. Flor. I think she's connected, right? But she's sick. Gloria. Here. Joanna. I'm here, teacher. Very good. Lourdes. Present. Margarita. Margarita. I'm here. Mayra. She's connected, I think, but she's doing something. Miguel? Miguel? Present teacher. Okay. Nelson? It's Present okay. teacher. Very good. Ophelia? Here, teacher. Osmin? Present teacher. Okay. Rafael? Present. Very good. Rosa? Present. Sandra? Present. Jansi? Present. Zulma? Here. Uh, Azalia? Azalia? Present. All right, Ingrid, thank you. Present, teacher. And Susana? Susana? She's not connected, right? Okay. Now listen. Um, now listen. Listen to this because it's very important. Okay, I will say it in Spanish. Uh, yo sé que cuando van a trabajar en equipo, eh, alguien escribe en algunas actividades y los demás hacen la captura de pantalla al final. Okay, and that's okay. Eso está bien hasta cierto punto. Okay, eso está bien hasta cierto punto. ¿Por qué hasta cierto punto? Porque si usted personalmente va escribiendo las respuestas en su cuaderno y no solo recibe la captura, usted va practicando su escritura, ¿ok? Pero si alguien... Ah, correctamente, pero en este caso solo el que lo está haciendo está practicando la escritura. Los demás no están practicando la escritura de, la, de, de lo que están haciendo, ¿ok? And that's okay, I mean, para algunas actividades que no hay mucho tiempo está bien. 
pero no se acomoden solo a que les manden la captura de pantalla. Escriban ustedes también para que practiquen escritura, ¿ok? How to spell words, cómo deletrear las, okay. las palabras. Eso es importante, that's important, ¿ok? No solo, ah, mandame la captura entonces o mandamelas al, ahí al chat. Ok, But that's ok, I mean, to a certain point, I repeat, eso está bien hasta cierto punto, pero es bueno que ustedes las escriban en su libreta, en su cuaderno de apuntes, ok? Yeah? Any questions about that? Teacher. Sorry? Yo las copio. Ok, excellent. Ok, that's very good. That's excellent. But I know that everybody does, pero sé que no todos lo hacen. Ok, algunos solo, mandame la captura. Ok? Pero por eso les estoy diciendo ahorita, para que practiquen, para que ustedes las escriban también y practiquen su escritura, ¿ok? ¿Ya? Yeah. Okay. Pueden compartir pantalla, así como lo hacen, okay, y, alguien, y alguien que lo esté haciendo en la computadora. A veces por el tiempo, teacher. A veces sí. por el tiempo, porque si no, no se termina. Si sí, no, entiendo. no está que el teacher. <ríe> el teacher tiene sí. la culpa, oh my goodness. Sí, entonces la que escribe ya va bien rápido y no, no, no. No, no sí, pero, sí. pero igual, teacher, corregimos. Ah, entonces, a veces o sea, puede ser que ah, está bien. Uno, uno. Uno a la vez, pero perdón, eh, Azalia y luego Sandra, que no entendí. Azalia. No, que ayudamos a corregir también si falta alguna letrita o algo. Vamos ayudando también, no solo él okay. lo hace, solo la persona que lo escribe lo hace. Entiendo, entiendo, pero es mejor cuando se escribe porque se le queda más a uno, porque está como, sí, ok, sí el, 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 el hecho de usar la, la, nuestra, nuestra mano para hacerlo, ese como que funciona mejor el cerebro, sí. ¿verdad? Y, y como que yes. vamos asimilando más la escritura del de la palabra, ok, ayuda más ok, exactly. good uh, so the, ok, thank you Sandra, sorry, you were saying something no, no. ok no. So, um, lo que podemos hacer es al menos si, si no tenemos tiempo, al menos avancemos en lo que podamos, pero al menos con tres oraciones que escribamos, aunque no las escribamos todas practicamos, verdad, we practice, right, ok good, and for the following activity, we are going to work in groups but listen, please everybody needs to write the sentences on their notebooks or, or on their photocopies or on the computer, okay? But the idea is that everybody writes. La idea es que todos escriban. The idea is that everybody writes, okay? Right. Now listen. Applying the explanation of wood better, um, organize the sentences on page number 41, okay? We have some sentences and they are disorganized. The idea is that you organize the sentences according to the explanation of wood better, okay? So for this, you are going to work in groups. Page number 41. Okay? Page number 41. If you have a photocopy, you can do it on your You can do it on your manual, all right? If you don't have the photocopy, on your computer or on your notebook, okay? Any question? Any question? No, no teacher. No question. All right. Okay, very good. Okay, let me reorganize the groups again. Okay, let's go to working groups then. ¿Por qué? 
La oyente soy yo, Florcita. <risa> Florcita. Okay. Ay, está, yo, está riendo, sí, yo creo que yo ahora no voy a estar. Está trabajando. Squirking. Okay. okay. De Hi, teacher. Number two. Para hola, para hola. <risa> Perdón, es un radio. Ah, <risa> yo, le, yo le iba a decir machado, machado, machado. Pa Pacheco, Pacheco. Pacheco, Pacheco, Pacheco. Estoy, estoy trabajando todavía. Es que yo, es que um, al seguridad que tengo yo, que tenemos allá, hay uno que le ha pedido machado, entonces y yo por no decirle Pacheco que, que el que se conoce le digo machado, machado, machado. <laughs> okay. Okay. Sentence number two. Uh, would, would it be better? Would it be better? Wouldn't it? No es y. No porque no es pregunta. No tiene signo de interrogación. Ah, ok. Entonces, would it be better? Could. To... Could. 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 Be it be better to revise? To revise the manual before printing. Printing, yes. Could it be better? Wouldn't it be better? It be better. It be better. Be better. To revise. To revise. Yeah. Yeah. The manual before printing. Before printing. Mm -hmm. eh, no sería mejor revisar el manual antes de imprimirlo. Creo que eso se traduce. Yes. Si no vamos a desperdiciar las páginas. Y estamos okay. en, en inglés, teacher, pero es que ya sabe. Ok. Okay, number three. Okay, number three. Good. 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 Aquí it sería, would good, be good. Be good. It would. Yeah. It would be good if good. we change the dress code. Mm -hmm. The dress code. Mm -hmm. Sería no. if, ¿verdad? If could. If, if could. could. If could. Be good. Be good. If we. It. We shame. If, if we. We shame. The dress. The dress. The dress code. Would be, would be. Number four. Uh, if could be, would be. If would be. To have a good idea. A, a, a good must... idea. No. A good, mm -hmm. a good a good idea to have to have a, to, to have a training a, manual a training. for chips. Yes. Manual for chips. Okay, I think number four, I will be 
a good idea to have a training manual for chef. Chef. Is correct pronunciation? It will be. Is share your microphone? Chefs. It will be. Uh, or or yeah. all the sentence. Chefs. I'm sorry, yeah. I did. Chefs. Exactly. Chefs. Okay. Chefs. Yeah, chefs. In plural is chefs. Chefs. Mm -hmm. chefs. 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 The chefs. Yes. Exactly. Exactly. As I said, chefs. Chefs. Tito como. Yes. Ratatouille. <risa> Recopilación de todas las actividades. Ah, verdad. Es como resumen de las dos semanas. Ajá, Ay, le miss a teacher ahorita. Ay, <risa> 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 oh, qué serio, teacher, qué serio, teacher. I'm, I'm kidding. So, are you done? Did you finish? Yes, yes, yes. Did, did, did everyone take notes? Yeah. Yes, yes, I agree. I agree. Okay. Great yeah, I see. <laughs> All right, let me visit another group and then we go out, okay? Okay. Okay. Entonces, en este caso sería good and eat. Good and eat. Be better to let the manager decide. Oh, the platform. In the platform. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí. No, I have two, but I have two with, with mistake. The number two and the number four, I think. I don't remember. But I have two. T-shirt. Sería así, teacher, porque es la única que me sale, porque le he puesto de la otra forma y me sale mala. En este caso, vaya, yo probándole, entonces quisiera decir que wouldn't it be, be better to let the manager decide? That's correct. Ok. But let me check something okay. quickly, okay? Let me check something quickly. I think there is a mistake in the platform, okay? It's not you. Yes, I mean, your your the, question is the, correct. It's the number five that have a mistake. Yeah, let me let me check something quickly here, okay? okay. Give me a minute. Mm -hmm. Give me a minute. Okay. Let me check something quickly. Okay, look at the uh -huh. wouldn't, wouldn't be better uh, it decide to let the manager? No, it wouldn't be better to let the manager decide. Y acá porque it, comenzamos con it. Ay, no, eso es que, que eso es lo que me he confundido yo. No sé ah, por qué. sorry, sorry. Okay. Uh -huh. Wouldn't it be better? Uh -huh. uh -huh. Let me. Let me. Ah, oh, yeah, yes. I, I, I understand that. Están ahorita ahí en el ejercicio, en la plataforma. Yes. I'm, I'm, yes. Uh, ¿Quién no tiene ahí la número, la número cinco es el problema, verdad? It's, it's, sí. like the, it's like the book. Ok, vaya, hágame un favor. Alguien que lo tenga ahí ahorita, que lo esté haciendo, eh, que le dé un espacio, que se vaya donde está la respuesta, que le dé un espacio y que inicie a escribir la respuesta. Okay. Space. Demos un espacio, ajá, space, y empezamos con capital R, con inicial mayúscula, ¿ok? Y al final le damos un espacio y después le ponemos sin una interrogación. Ah, no, de esa manera, a ver qué tal, Ros. A ver si sale espacio bueno. Espacio y espacio, teacher. Espacio y espacio. Uh -huh. Yes. Capital R, space, and at the end, space. Ajá, espacio al principio y al final. Nada. Dice, este, no, ya no, no lo estoy, no tengo, no estoy en la computadora. Ok. Estoy para... No, teacher. No. No. Ok. 
the space at the end, at the, at the beginning, a capital letter. Wouldn't it be better to let... ¿Puedes compartirme pantalla rosa para ver? Quiero, quiero ver. Yes, okay, sí, sí. wait. Let me, let me, let me. Mira, ahora nosotros vamos a estar creyentes, ¿verdad? Okay. A esa oración, la 5 específicamente. Yes. Oh, oh es la 2 o la 5. La 5 está no, bien. No, I have, I, I have number 2 and number 5. Ok, en la 2, bueno, espacio al principio, pero esa apóstrofe no es así, la apóstrofe no es así como está ahí. Oh, ok, maybe that's it. Es rectecita, es rectecita, es rectecita, así. ¿Sí? Ajá, ah, espacio, okay. espacio al principio. Okay. No, es, no, ahí no, ahí okay. no lleva espacio okay. al principio. Yes. Tenemos libre espacio ahí. Okay. Ah, uh -huh. Y un espacio okay. al final, uh, wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide, antes, después del sitio de decide, antes del signo de interrogación, otro espacio. Ahí. Ajá, signo de interrogación, question mark. Okay. Let me find the question mark. It is so difficult in this, in this keyboard. For Copy me. paste. Copy and paste Copy it paste. if you don't find it. Ah, okay. Let me find. Let me find. Okay, now yeah. check. Now yeah. check, please. Okay, wait. Go check now. No. No, same problem. No, yeah, doesn't change okay. the, the punctuation. Okay, la numero dos, number la two. Numero, yeah, number two, I have, I don't know. Okay, pon, ese, pon mayúscula al principio. Wouldn't, wouldn't it be better? Wouldn't it be better? To revise, uh -huh. okay, I want to see. To revise. The menu before enter. Okay, go check now. Yes, let me find. No. Oh, no, okay. No. Okay, stop sharing, please. I will ask. Okay. Voy okay. a preguntar mañana otra vez but, porque no me he contestado. But, but Miguel yeah. has, okay. has okay the number two. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's kind of weird. Hay que preguntar eh, a Miguel okay. ¿cuál, cuál es el truco, okay. cuál es el trick. <risa> Pero en este caso, en este caso, Fisher, este, sería, estaría en lo correcto el wouldn't it. Yes, it's correct, it's correct. Wouldn't it be better, it's correct. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yes, Lord, this, this number una, five una, is wouldn't it. Una, ah, una, okay. una, ¿qué? una pregunta. Cuando es negativa, siempre va a ir el wouldn't, el no wouldn't primero, y okay. después it. Yes, exactly. Okay. Wouldn't uh -huh. it be better? Uh, wouldn't yeah. it be better? Como que no sería mejor hacer esto. Okay. Wouldn't it be better to do this? Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Gracias, teacher. Yeah. Ahí es solo esperar la plataforma entonces. Yes. Let's wait. Okay. See tomorrow. Gracias. Gracias okay. Teacher. Entonces quedaría, okay. wouldn't it be better uh -huh. to decide yeah. to, the, to no. let the manager? No. Wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide? No sería mejor, sería mejor, no sería que, mejor, no dejar, sería mejor dejar que el manager decida. Nosotros pagamos la planilla. Uh -huh. sería uh -huh. uh -huh. Wooden uh -huh. eat. eat. Okay. Ajá, uh -huh. wouldn't it be better? Hello teacher. Hello. Uh, so uh, basically, uh, I, here, I I fixed the 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 last the last one. What is? I know what is the what is the error? Is, what is the error? It is the apostrophe. The apostrophe. Yes. What happened with the I apostrophe? Is is there is a uh, uh, let me let me share. Okay. Oh no! Oh no! Share. Uh, Just say it. In the uh, I have. Uh, good in in the platform, okay. It's okay, but but uh, the the order is bad because I uh, compare com, compare the the two and the apostrophe not equal, okay. I change mm -hmm. the the order the 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 bad 
in um, I prove and is correct. Mm, okay, so, so you, you are saying that you put a different apostrophe. Yes, it's in the in the keyboard have to uh, to apostrophe say this to apostrophe on the one keyboard. Is, yes, in the keyboard. One uh, is a one straight, is, one is a straight, and the other one is like comia, right? Yes, yes. And the one like comia is correct. Yes, uh, yes. Mm. Teacher, I I change, I copy paste the wooden in the number two and. And copy paste, and it's okay. <laughs> I have only the number five of a room. And the one you're saying is number five, Miguel? Yes. Yes, it's the number ah, five. Okay, I'm going ah, to okay, the, the number five. The number two and the number, I have the number two correct. Yes. Uh, and number because, five, too. Uh, and number five is, is incorrect by me because I changed the, the apostrophe in the number five. And, and we have it is the correct. Problem. And it's yes. correct. Okay, uh, okay. The, then uh, we need in number five, en caso que, que vamos, yo creo que mañana van a, van a revisar, pero entonces en la última, lo voy a decir en español, uh -huh. nos está compartiendo Miguel que el wouldn't, la apóstrofe la lleva diferente, lo que hiciste es copiar y pegar, ¿verdad Miguel? Así como aparece en el ejemplo. Sí, quizás, este, ay, como ay. ahí lo digita uno, ¿verdad? Quizás en algún momento el apóstrofe en la segunda lo digité de una manera distinta a la última. Okay. La segunda me salía bien y la última, ¿no? Okay. Pero ya cambiando, analizando esa situación, y ya me cambió la dos, a las dos correctas con el cambio vaya, de apóstrofe. Vaya, vaya, vaya. Vamos a ver si if I get you. Yes, teacher, I, I do it. And it's vaya, en esa última, now. lo que tienen que hacer es entonces, Miguel, copiar el wooden. Mejor. Yes, sí, I do eh, it. Copio. A wooden y después lo siguen copiando normal todo. Wooden it be yes. better. Two, bla, 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 y ahí continúa. Sí, ¿verdad? Yes. yes. Y yes. en la number two, y en la number two. The same. It's the same. The same. It's the same. Copy, the same. copy the wooden. Copy. Uh -huh. Copiamos uh -huh. el wooden. And then the rest. Y que tiene este wooden, entonces, que no nos sale bien a nosotros. I tried. <laughs> I, I do it, and I have the, all the points. Okay. So, wouldn't it be better? Y luego siguen lo mismo, okay? So, copy, paste. Entonces, copiamos y pegamos para que nos salga bien, okay? And we fix uh, the problem, okay? Yeah, this is for everyone. This is for everyone. This is for everyone, okay? Teacher. Yeah. I have a problem in la tarea 2.14. No sé si alguien ya la hizo. Yes, the, I have. A, hay una parte en la que tienes que poner first, eh, second, then finally. Entonces, en la número 2, yo ya intenté con second, con next, y, y siempre me la pone mal. It's afterwards, ahí, ¿verdad? Yeah, after, the, after, after, that. After, after that. After that. No sé si after. es after that o afterwards. Esa, esa no. de ahí la respuesta. Ah, ok. Gracias. Ok, all right. Ok, what, very what good. ¿Cuál dijo, dijo Joan? In, the, in, in homework 2.14, en la tarea 2.14, la de first, after that, afterwards, then, finally, in that one. Sí, en la... En la primera es first, la segunda es afterwards, en la tercera es then, y la otra es final. Yeah, there you go, okay, yeah, it's afterwards, okay, that's what I was saying, afterwards. Angela, the last time, afterwards, the second, uh -huh. okay, thank you, Miguel, thank you very much. Okay, okay, uh, okay, okay. so uh, let's continue then, and listen, uh, we are going to, oh my goodness, I'm not supposed to share this anymore, okay. Mi cámara se apagó. Okay, so here we have the sentences you were completing. So let's see on uh, number two. Who wants to share number two? Who wants to share number two? Me. Okay, go ahead. Okay, Miguel. Number two. 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 Number Printing, exactly. Okay, Printing. wouldn't, okay, wouldn't it be it better be to revise the menu before, the before printing. printing? Yeah, that's okay. Okay, thank you very much. The pronunciation for this is revise. Revise. Revise, revise. revise. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Number three, volunteers. Okay, go ahead. It's cool. 
Can you teach them? Okay, go ahead, Ingrid. Okay, so if it's going to be good, um, we change the dress code. Repeat it, please. It's going to be, be good if we change the dress code. Okay, that's excellent. It would be good if we change the dress code. Y lo que les decía, miren, el verbo va en pasado. The verb is in, in past, okay? Perfect. Thank you very much, Ingrid. Let's see number four. Volunteers for number four. Me, teacher. Okay, Osmin. It would be a good idea to have a training manual for chef. Excellent. It would be a good idea to have a training manual for chefs. Okay, thank for you, chef. Osmin. And the last one, number five. Volunteers for number five. Me, teacher. Okay, Ada. Okay, Ada. Good. Wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide? Okay, thank you. That's excellent. Wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide? No sería mejor dejar al, al jefe, okay, al manager que decida. Okay, wouldn't it be better to let the manager decide? Okay, thank you very much. No. Okay, um, thank you very much for, uh, for sharing. And now we have 23 minutes for the last activity, okay? We have 23 minutes for the last activity. I guess you are finished this activity, but the idea is that we advance as much as we can, okay? La idea es que avancemos tanto como podamos, to advance as much as we can. Okay, listen carefully, please. You are going to work in groups, but listen carefully. In groups of three, okay? Por favor, los que van a trabajar ahorita, mañana, traten de estar temprano para que no quede solo uno en el grupo mañana, ¿ok? A más tardar, a más tardar a las 8 que se conecten, por favor, ¿ok? Si tienen algún atraso, conéctense del teléfono. Si vienen en el bus, conéctense del teléfono y luego se conecta con, con su compu, si se conectan con compu, ¿ok? But try to be connected at 8 tomorrow. Mañana traten de conectarse a las 8 para que trabajen juntos siempre, ¿ok? So, listen. In this activity, you are going to create you are going to create in groups, right? You are going to create a mini training manual. A mini training manual, not a big manual. No, a mini, a mini training manual. For what is your decision, okay? For what is your decision? The, I mean, the purpose is your decision. Can be for, it depends on your company, right? It depends on your company. It can be for, uh, for accountants, it can be for human resources, could be for um, quality control, uh, for, I don't know, okay, for any department you want or for any people you want, you decide, okay, it's your decision, yeah? So what are you going to include in the manual? ¿Qué van a incluir? A little index, a little index, all right? A little index, the purpose, a short purpose, like two or three lines, okay? Dos o tres líneas como propósito. The purpose of the manual, all right? Two or three lines. The purpose is like the objective of the manual, all right? Like two or three lines. And finally, the different parts of the manual, okay? The different parts of the manual. Mm -hmm. Así como teníamos el, el, el índice que teníamos aquí, the different parts, okay? But it depends on the on the idea you have, okay? If it's for human resources, of course, the steps are going to be different. If it's for quality control, the steps are going to be different. If it's for secretaries, the steps are going to be different, okay? Yeah, so the idea is to create a short manual. Now listen, in every step, put a short description, okay? Para cada paso, pongan una breve descripción, put a short description, okay? How many steps you decide? ¿Cuántos pasos ustedes deciden? Pero no incluyan muchos. It's a short manual, right? It's a, it's a mini manual, okay? It's a mini manual. Any question? Any question? It's creating a manual. Yes, but a mini manual, not a big one, okay? A mini one. Okay, mini, okay. A mini manual, yeah. I repeat. I'm confused, confusing, teacher. A little, a little index, a little index, okay? 
the purpose of the manual, the purpose of the training manual, el propósito de ese manual de capacitación. You decide what for. Ustedes deciden para qué. You decide what for, okay? And the parts. Maybe you can put like four parts, four little parts, and a little description for each for each part. Y una descripción corta para cada parte, okay? Yeah? Questions? Yes. Questions? A little index. Yes. How do you say it? Yeah, the, the index, in the index, you will include the purpose and the different steps. If you have four steps, the index and the four steps, right? Okay, only that. First time, yeah. Yeah. Have a little time. Sorry? Have a little time. It's okay, don't worry. I mean, I'm saying you can start working today and we continue tomorrow, okay? Por eso les digo que mañana se conecten temprano para que sigamos trabajando otros 15, 20 minutos. So we continue working other 15 or 20 minutes, okay? Yeah, pero la idea es que mañana se conecten todos temprano para que lo podamos hacer. Any question? No questions? No? No. Okay, all right. So if we have no questions, let's start working. Traten de recordar con quién van a trabajar, por favor. Try to remember who you are going to work with, okay? Maybe. Mm, um, Primero el, el propósito. Mm, identificar la entrada de, de dinero. Saber cuánto es la entrada que tiene la caja chica. Ajá, puede ser como training, ¿verdad? Training about. Eh, about the. the Financial in words, no sé, porque me imagino que tiene que darle como una introducción, ¿va? como de qué, qué es caja chica, eh, en qué consisten las entradas, las salidas. Entonces me imagino como training, sí. eh, training de, de cashier about the basic financial words. O podemos Podría hacer, hacer uno, uno de, ¿Sí? de, sele, de selección de personal, digamos. Que el propósito sería ajá. como... Este, Contratar. Bueno, sería un procedimiento ajá, diseñado para, para cubrir plazas vacantes, para seleccionar personal o, 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 o seleccionar algún perfil. Y los pasos uh -huh. serían, ¿verdad? Primero los requisitos, sería un análisis del puesto, una entrevista, este, no 
digamos, una entrevista. Ok, pongamos este but, para but, ir but, avanzando, digamos. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But in the manual, um, we are not going to put requirements, all right? You only need to put the index, the purpose, and the parts. Index, purpose, and parts. What Porque is the meaning? meaning? What is the meaning? Index. Index. Indice, 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 in the parts, mm -hmm. the steps. No requirements. I mean, it's a short manual, right? It's not a big thing. It's a mini manual. Okay. okay. So no requirements. All right. Okay. Entonces pongamos en el... Okay. Pongamos entonces como hire the new employee. ¿Les parece? Contratar un nuevo empleado. Uh -huh. Sí, está bien. Se va a ser como el man manual. Ajá, manual eh, for here the new employee. O employees. And the, fair, eh, the, the propose is hire eh, seleccionar hire a uh, Hire and select and select in personal. Ajá, uh -huh, personal. A core, creo que es como acorde, ¿no? Ajá, uh -huh, core. According. According. According to. According to. According, according, according to. According to. To the yeah. specific area. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí, tenemos que hacer presentación o solo lo vamos a leer. Yes, you will present. Ok. Pero lo podemos hacer Muy mañana, bien, a ver, en el tiempo que nos va a dar. Ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Ahorita quizás es de armarlo. Entonces, uh -huh. en specific area. Eh, solo así dejémoslo el propósito. Para no ir tan allá. And then uh, the the steps. Index. Index. Ah, uh, the index. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, index. First. Um, first. Um, training. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. No. Uh, first. First. Um, como look for. Look for. Yeah. Um, the, the new employee um, according to requirements. Como buscar un nuevo empleado acorde a, a los requerimientos o requisitos. Sería como publicar este, la vacante. Ajá, publicar. Publicar podría ser. Publicar la oferta laboral podría ser. Ajá. O publicar en bolsas de trabajo. No, no, no sé. uh -huh. Entonces, ¿cómo se pone publicar? A ver. Publicar. Yo le digo. Publicar oferta laboral en bolsas de trabajo. Publicar. Tu post me sale publicar. Tu post. Ajá, me aparece publish offer. Bueno, le pongo publicar oferta. Ah, me aparece post a job offer. Ajá, post, post first, job, pongamos offer. Post, ajá, a yo offer. Post, 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 job, uh -huh. post, 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 a yo offer. Okay. In, in the, in the post of the job. Te coloco. <laughs> But, ah. A little index. ¿Cuál sería, ¿Cuál sería el propósito? 
por ah, pues, cierto, ah. eh, satisfacer las necesidades de, 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 de los clientes y consumidores. Clientes y consumidores a través de productos de calidad. Ah, productos de Ajá. Y realmente algo así ese sería el, pro, el sería el propósito sería satisfacer eh, necesidades de ese sería las necesidades del cliente o del consumidor aunque el manual que estamos elaborando es como para que una persona conozca ese proceso como que un trabajador que un trabajador conozca el proceso del producto los pasos a seguir Therefore, uh -huh. Ese sería el propósito, ¿no? Sí, más, más va enfocado al, al trabajador que a los Al trabajador, al que ¿sí? conozca el proceso de, 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 de fabricación de, 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 de los productos de papel, ¿cierto? Uh -huh. es... Ok, entonces sería... El propósito. Ajá, las que están restringidas. Ya no que tienen acceso. Empecemos. Entonces, el primero podría ser en la hora del check-in. Sí. Okay, hora sí. de check. Ajá, primero. Hora. Está en su check-in and check-out, un solo, de una vez. Ok. Eh, sería... Pero también aquí dice de... Así, ¿verdad? Check-in... Check-out. Check-in y ponemos la hora, ¿verdad? Ah, no, porque solo son las indicaciones. Ajá. Solo sería check in, check out. Ah, y hay que hacer una descripción por cada una. Pero yo creo que sería mejor empezar con los pasos y después ir, ir para que el tiempo no se nos... Pero podemos seguir mañana. Bueno, entonces en la hora del check-in, respetar, respetar el horario que el hotel este, brinda o algo así. O poner eh, el hotel, establece, check-in, tal hora, check-out, tal hora. La hora de entrada y salida. Oh, sorry, sorry, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Hello. Um, what is the manual you are creating for? For example, uh, um, uh, I, I was so confused. Maybe I I I know that it's a training menu. Yeah. A train a training that menu in this case. In, if we're talking about a hotel, it, the training menu is for me, the client. How to use the the installation? Installation. Is for how to use the, the installations of the, the facilities. hotel, the, 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 facilities. Facilities the, the facilities of the hotel, maybe the gym. Mm -hmm. I mean, but the, the, but, the, but the manual, is it for the customer or for the, or for the employees? For the customer. Custom. Customers. Mm -hmm. No. Yeah, I mean, because how are you supposed to train the customers? Because uh -huh. it's a training manual. Uh -huh, yes. You are not uh -huh. going to train the customers. Uh -huh. You are going yes. to train the staff, the, stra yes. the staff of the uh -huh. hotel, OK? Uh -huh. OK. Uh -huh. I yeah. have to train the staff, not the, the, staff, the, not the, the customers. The, the, not the customers. Exactly. Uh -huh. So please switch uh -huh. it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. OK. Entonces sería recibir al, al recibir al cliente. Ajá. How to receive a, a, a the client? How to receive a excursion? I don't know. Uh -huh. Teacher, mm -hmm. ¿cómo se le dice 
No, ya se va. No. I'm here, I'm here. No I'm saying I'm here. Al que está hospedado. Okay. The, host. the host. The host. The host. Host. The host. host. El huésped. Ajá, uh -huh. the host. Uh -huh. Okay. Or let, let me check. Con, but continue, continue working. It's okay. I have that. Okay. Entonces sería eh, recibir, ¿verdad? Yes. Recibir el huésped. How to recite the, the yes? Recibir Recibir the guest Guest, ajá, uh -huh, the guest Ajá, uh -huh, the guest 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 Yeah, yes. uh, guest. Yes. Uh -huh. yeah host is guest uh -huh. Yeah, host is the person uh -huh, El the que official. aloja El que aloja, ajá Ajá So it's uh, guest okay. Entonces sería Receive the guest Ajá uh -huh. Ok Seco. Eh, mostrarle el cuarto, algo así. Eh, no, este, llevarle el equipaje, el equipaje y entregarle la. Ajá, o sea, no sé, como que van a recepción. Le tra... Yes, tell me. Tell me. Each question is. Is context uh, explication. Sorry, can you repeat your question? Uh, each uh, the step, uh, I need explication. Yes, a short, a short, sure. uh, yeah, yeah, short, a short one, okay, a short description. Very short, okay. not, not maybe like two lines, okay? Okay. okay. A short description. Six steps. Okay. okay, it's okay. Six steps is okay. And you write a short description, not long, a short description for every step, okay? okay. Like Thank two you. lines, okay? No more than two lines. Okay. okay, good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. In the first is election candidate, we can, can make a revise, revise, Curriculums, ¿cómo se dice curriculum en inglés? Curriculum vitaes, vitaes. Ah, es lo mismo. Okay. You can say CV, CV, okay? To check CV. CVs, okay. CVs. Uh -huh. okay. Entonces, es así como la selección de, de o recepción de, de CV. Uh -huh. Receiving, receiving CVs. Receiving, uh -huh. receiving CVs. Recibir los currículos, okay? Recibida. Receiving CVs. Yeah. So. For the We can precise CVs for choose personal candidate potential employees. Only that. Only that. What? Only that. Only. Okay. Con cuál idea? Ah, so, sorry to interrupt candidate you. Potential Sorry to interrupt you. Uh, Nelson, you have the one-on-one -on -one session today, right? Sorry? Nelson, you have the one-on-one -on -one session today. Uh, ah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, perfect. Continue. Number two, make evaluation. Uh, make evaluation like... Uh, ¿Cómo sería? Bueno, ¿Serán pruebas psicológicas, matemáticas y de escritura? Make, ¿Qué sería? Make, make exams. ¿Cómo se le puede resumir en las pruebas? 
¿Cómo, Gloria? Test. Ah, test. Yes. Test. Uh -huh. What do you say proves? ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo dice las pruebas que in my case I, I make proves mathematics, I, I do orthograph? The math says uh, um, psychology. psychology. Uh -huh. O sea, todo en test. Test psicológico, yes. matemático, de escritura. Okay. Correcto. Bueno, Sandrita nos faltó, pero le pasamos la copia. Okay, everyone. So let me pass the attendance the last time. Okay, then I give an instruction. Ada? Present. Adriana? Ana Michelle? Present, teacher. Okay, thank you. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, teacher. Darwin? Present, teacher. Flor? Gloria? Here? Joanna? I'm here, teacher. Lourdes? Here. Margarita. I'm here. Mayra. Miguel. Present. Nelson. Present. Ofelia. Here, teacher. Osmin. Present, teacher. Good Rafael. Night. Good night, Rafael. Present. Good night. No. No se me salgan todavía, que le voy a dar una instrucción, okay. please. Ok, please, okay. please. Please, ok. Bye, good night. Uh, Rosa. Present. Sandra. Present. Jansi. Present. Zulma. Here. Azalia. Aquí estoy, teacher. All right. Present. Ingrid. Ok, Ingrid. Present. And Susana. Ok, solo antes de que nos vayamos. Um, Present. Bueno, ok, Susana. Present. Present. Ok, ah, no se me duerma. <ríe> Muy bien, eh, antes de que salgamos, eh, para, para el manual que están haciendo, para cada paso solo escriban una, una descripción cortita para cada paso, no más de dos líneas, ok, para mañana que trabajemos, ok. Y para el propósito. Ya, ya no, no avanzamos bastante para que diga eso. Ok, no hay problema, no hay problema. There's no problem para los que faltan. Si escribieron más de dos líneas, no hay problema. Mejor porque tienen más vocabulario. Y es amor vocabulario, ok? No problem. Ok. Eh, es para, para que. Bien. Ajá, ya, yeah, it's ok. Y, eh, si, tiene, si tiene una explicación para una hora, no importa. Sí. <risa> yes. <risa> Yes, of course. <ríe> y otra, <ríe> otra cosa, eh, mañana por favor traten de conectarse temprano todos los que trabajaron para que no se quede solo una persona trabajando. No creo que quieran dejar solito a su compañero trabajando, ¿verdad? Creo que quieren estar todos, así que conectarse temprano para que le ayuden a su compañero. A más tardar a las 8 y 4, porque a esa hora yo estoy pasando asistencia, a más tardar. Ok, si no, si no, I mean, if you can, if it's possible, a las 8 o un poquito antes, ¿ok? Para que podamos okay, apoyar a los compañeros, teacher. al equipo. Háganlo por el yes, equipo. Teacher. Do it for the team, ¿ok? Yes, y siempre no olviden plataforma. Miércoles, antes de la sesión, debe estar completa la sesión número 2. ¿Ok? ¿Ya? Yeah. Ok. Perfecto.
Okay, thank you very much for connecting today. See you tomorrow and good night. Bye, teacher. Bye, bye. Everybody. Bye, yeah, bye. Bye, bye. Teacher, el manual es tipo presentación. Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. Good night. Good night. Yeah. Good night. Michelle. Bye. Michelita. Yes. I like. I like. Your presentation. Ay, thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> bye. bye. Bye bye. Okay, now. This space is for you. Solo estaba poniendo en el waiting room algunos que se les había olvidado por ahí. Ok. Uh, for me, uh, I, I think I, I advance in, in know the, the language and pronunciation and more, more vocabulary. Uh, yes. Only, only, only doubt a question yeah. is and use the go or me is sign, but I confuse the use of the go and my my it's a moda. Uh huh. Could ah could and might. Yeah. Could and might. Okay, very yeah. good. Okay, let me share the the board with you here. Okay, okay, so you're saying that you uh, have problems using could and might, right? I did. Yeah. Okay, first, how do you translate could? ¿Cómo traduces could? Podría. Okay, and might? Tal vez, puede que Hold on a second. Solo dame un segundo, give me a second, please. Oh my goodness. Sus. Okay, okay. Let's see here. Okay, so could, ese día podría, and might? Es, es casi lo mismo. Es lo mismo, exactly. Es lo mismo. It's the same, okay? Could. Es lo mismo y might es lo mismo. Maybe, uh, there's no big difference. Depende tal vez el contexto en el que se usa, pero en realidad se usan casi lo mismo. It's the same. Solo que si hablamos de certidumbre, los mismos tienen el mismo nivel de certidumbre si estamos hablando en futuro, ¿ok? If we are speaking in future. For example, I can say, uh, you could, um, uh, you could um, go, uh, go to, to metro, to metro centro, ¿ok? You could go to metro centro, we can say tomorrow, for example, ¿ok? You could go to Metro Centro uh, tomorrow. Podrías ir a Metro Centro mañana. Aquí fácilmente en este contexto podría usar el, el might. Okay? So I can say, uh, you might go to Metro Centro tomorrow. Para expresar um, que algo es una posibilidad. Something is a possibility, all right? Yes? yes but it's the same. But, but, but it confuses when, when use. I mean, okay. it's the same Who purpose. Omits? It's the same, the same purpose. It's for possibility in the future. Yeah, good. Uh -huh. Y solo tal vez que el could no se puede usar en pasado y el, el, el might, sorry. Y el could en un contexto sí podría ser pasado, ¿ok? Porque es el pasado de qué, no obviamente, right? Obviously, right? So, el could podría ser utilizado en pasado. Y el might no se puede porque el might es para posibilidad en futuro. Futuro. ¿Ok? Ajá. Esa es la diferencia. That's the difference, mainly. Okay. Y el could, también, el could, se puede usar para, para preguntas, for questions, ¿ok? El could se puede usar para preguntas, y el might no es común en preguntas. Uh, for example, uh, uh, could you, ¿ok? Could you come here, please? ¿Podría venir, por favor? Could you come here, please? No digo, might you come here, please, ¿ok? Could, could you come here, please? ¿Podría venir, por favor? El my casi, bueno, yo no lo he visto en preguntas de hecho. I haven't seen it in questions. So you can use could in questions, ¿ok? Podría venir, por favor. Could you come here, please? ¿Ok? Sí. But, bueno, 
is concurrent. But I, I clarify. You are clear about that. Yeah. You are clear yeah, about yeah, the situation. Yeah. Okay. Any other topic you want to know about, or anything else you want to know about? Algo más? No. Only, only this. Is only that. Confused, but uh, your your application, I, I, I clear. Okay. Very good. Um. So, what are you doing for pronunciation? Um, I, I, I check a uh, more video and but uh, only only conversation uh, in english i okay. hear okay yes. very good okay that's excellent very good and for vocabulary uh, uh, the vocabulary uh, i read uh, books uh, 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 internet okay uh, only very good. Uh, manual manual technician okay and for grammar in the grammar i have a uh, Books and the ocean. Ocean. Ocean books. Yes, I have. I have. Okay. Two, two, two books. Okay. Very the, good. The grammar. Okay. Good. Yeah. What I feel is that you need to work a lot in vocabulary and grammar. Okay. Donde debes trabajar un poquito más es en gramática y en vocabulario. You need to work in grammar and vocabulary because I feel that you have vocabulary. But sometimes you put the, the vocabulary, like you say it, you think in Spanish and then you say it in English. Okay, yes. Spanish and English, and that's normal. But the idea is to get more grammar to speak better. La idea sería como obtener un poquito más de gramática para estructurar un mejor el vocabulario que tengo. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, I, I, I think the, the I, no, I, I see video, the, the, the bird, the get, get is, is more, more information. The, okay. The, the, the bird, the, the getting. Get, get getting the different uh, occasion in the okay. use the get. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, that's, that's what I mean. I, I would recommend because sometimes we have to watch more like pure grammar, okay? I would recommend this website that is called ingbid.com.com, ingbid.com, como English, pero solo ing, ing, y luego bid como el principio de video, ing bid. And Aha.com. Ahí hay videos de gramática de diferentes. You have different levels, diferentes niveles, different levels, okay? So you can check the videos you want. And there is a quiz. Y hay un quiz con el video. Al solo terminar de ver el video, you can, you can take a little quiz. Puedes tomar un pequeño examen about, okay. the, about, about the grammar. That's, that's interesting. Yes. And, and, and this is a course. And the level, I have the more 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 letter than English. Yeah, okay, perfect. That's really cool. Okay, you feel that? Yes. Okay, that's excellent. Keep it up. Okay, let's continue like that. Okay, thank you, teacher. Keep okay, okay, thank you very much for connecting to the one-on-one -on -one session. So I don't know if you have more questions. No, in, in, your, in your evaluation for me? Yeah, that's, that's what I was saying. I was saying, yeah, grammar. I feel you need mainly grammar. That's why I am recommending a website for grammar uh -huh. that is in bid.com. All right. I will send it to your, to your contact, to your WhatsApp. Okay. 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 okay Nelson. Thank you very much. Okay. Good night. Okay. okay good night.